to my channel my name is Jane and today I am doing a video all about these Doc Martin 1461s these are the shoes that I feel like sort of <laughs> blew up all over the internet especially on Instagram and Pinterest I feel like they're kind of like that Pinterest girl shoe but today I'll be sharing with you guys three different outfits of how I would personally style these shoes and yeah hopefully you guys can take some inspiration from these outfits and sort of incorporate it into your own closet but yeah i'll also be doing a review on these shoes later on in the video so if you guys want to skip to that you can skip here <laughs> If you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, please let me know by hitting the subscribe button and liking this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get started. So for the first outfit, I personally think these shoes look so cute with dresses of any kind. I'm wearing this mini floral one from Brandy Melville and I layered it with a cropped cable knit cardigan to add a more layered and put together look. I love the contrast between the girliness of the dress as well as the edginess that the shoes did. When wearing these shoes, I think they look best with ankle socks so I wore these white ones to elongate my legs a little more and add a sort of fun and vintage feel to the whole look. And to continue the whole vintage aesthetic, I added my little green bag from Vivian Westwood. I love this bag so much because it kind of reminds me of the 90s. I feel like along with the shoes and socks, the outfit already is very vintage and adding this bag just topped it off. <laughs> And I also wanted a pop of color to the outfit because it was a little bit too dark for me. And yeah, there you go. Outfit one. For my second outfit, I styled my docks with a skirt. I personally think these shoes look so cute with skirts. And again, it's the contrast between the girliness of the skirt and the chunkiness of the shoes that I love so much. I think it really balances the whole look really well. I'm wearing a white cardigan I got from Brandy Melville. And on top, I layered this oversized leather blazer I got from Zara. And honestly, leather blazers have been super trendy recently, so if you guys don't have one, I highly recommend one. They're so easy to wear and very cute. And to tone down the whole look, I added a mini skirt and the sheer black tights. And then to elongate my legs more, I wore these black socks with my dots and chose a cute headband since I didn't really want the blazer and dots to overpower the girliness of the look. And finally, I added more color by wearing my Vivian Westwood bag. And yeah, there you go. Outfit two. For the third outfit, I styled my docks with baggy jeans because I think these shoes look amazing with a pair of baggy pants, baggy jeans, baggy anything. And on top, I wanted to sort of play with color a bit more because my jeans are a little bit darker and I just wanted a pop of color so I styled it with this knit sweater vest that is from Brandy Melville and it's in this beautiful baby blue color. And brown has also been super trendy recently, so I got this brown argyle 
cardigan from the open product and yeah i felt like my neck area was a little bit boring so i also um layered underneath a collared shirt to add a little bit of preppiness to the outfit and also collars have been super trendy recently and to top the whole look off i wore a shoulder bag from Simon Day. i love this shoulder bag so much and it also just adds more i guess trendiness and sort of brings up your outfit a bit more because the baggy pants already sort of like drags your outfit down so just by wearing a shoulder bag it sort of brings back the whole look if that makes sense and yeah that is outfit three okay so on to the review about these shoes so i remember i sort of had my eye on these shoes for quite a while but they were just sold out everywhere on um the actual doc martin's website but I was able to buy them off of ASOS, so you guys can check out ASOS. And also for the sizing of these shoes, I got mine in a size 7, which I usually wear a size 7.5, but because Doc Martens only come in whole sizes, I just took the size down. So I'm usually between a 7 and a 7.5 and for whole sizes. I always just go for the 7 and I don't really size up because 8 is just way too big for me. But yeah, these shoes fit perfectly on my feet and I was really scared they weren't going to fit me. But yeah, I recommend just going for your usual size or taking a size down from your usual half size. And then on to how versatile these shoes are. I actually have the Jaden platforms which are like the the boot version of these shoes and i've had those for i think around two years and i just wear those everywhere i love those shoes to death they're like my babies <laughs> um like also wanted to buy these shoes because of i guess sort of like the trendiness of them i knew that these like platform chunky oxfords were really trendy um, I know like Prada and like other stores like Zara um, and other stores they were selling these kind of Oxford shoes so I kind of wanted to join the trend but realistically these are really trendy and really wearable but I feel like I do wear my Jaden boots more. I think those shoes I can just wear all season but these shoes I feel like I wear them more during like warmer weather because I like to wear these with like dresses and skirts. You can also wear them with baggy pants but I feel like if you have the Jaden platform boots you can just kind of wear those and pretend they're like these Oxfords. They give like the same style because they're all just covering your shoe up to here like the pants so i feel like there's no really there's not much need for these shoes but other than that i feel like these shoes are still very very cute and very very easy to wear it just really depends on how you style them i feel like they just go in everyone's closet everyone's style and you can just dress it up dress it down but i do just feel like if you were choosing between the boot version and these oxfords i would go with the boots because i think they're just more easy to wear they just go with i guess more outfits but it also depends on what you like okay that is the end of the video i really really hope you guys enjoyed this video and please let me know if you guys enjoyed it in the comments or give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe for more videos from me thank you so much for supporting me and leaving such nice comments it honestly means the world to me and it's so nice to be able to like hear back from you guys who are watching my video so thank you so much and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye